Luck be a lady tonight. Luck be a lady tonight. Luck be a lady and that lady be a number. Luck be a lady tonight. <laughs> Welcome back to Elf Off The Top. My name is Adam and today is the day, believe it or not, in this COVID world where shipping, I post something and it arrives 14 weeks later and I was literally shipping it to around the corner. Believe it or not, the dominance arrived to me early from Select, which means today, this weekend, we're cracking it open. I was actually going to crack open my team 2018 for this weekend's videos, but nope. Dominance takes precedence over that. We're going to be cracking this open and we're going to be doing two parts because I love a chat. You guys know that. And we're going to see what we get. There's the uh, the cards that are all included along with that. If you were following along with my preview videos, you know all about these yet. I was spot on. I guess the ratios. I guess all these ratios on the side and I was actually spot on. Uh, with all of them. So Phil Premiership commemorative is one in 36 packs. Okay, that one we didn't know. So a chem we get one commemorative in, in each box. Um, we'll get one signature as well. We'll get a couple of rookies, couple of on the rise, couple of Australian, couple of parallels. And then this is all from here onwards is all just pure luck, pure luck. And maybe, just maybe, this is a lucky box. We need that luck to be a lady and the lady to be numbers and those numbers to be cards. This is probably easily the most hyped, excited set of AFL football cards in the history of collecting. The speed at which this box sold out in the pre-sale, um, I will explain a little bit why it sold out so quickly in this video, but um, it was 30 seconds and cases were gone and boxes were gone within five minutes. It was all sold out on the pre-sale. And uh, well, let's just talk about it right now. This right here that I'm gonna pull, pull up on the screen, this explains exactly why. So. Uh, Select had a pre-pre-sale, I guess you would call it, for distributors and retailers. And that was absolutely crazy where more than two thirds of that box, the boxes were actually picked up by, at distributors and retails. And when it went live at 10.30 a.m., there was only, you know, there was less than 2,000 of these things available for people to actually buy. So that's how it sold out so quickly. I was so lucky to get this box. People are buying these for crazy amounts on eBay. Please don't buy them for crazy amounts on eBay. I could easily pop this on eBay, make my money back, and then some. But we're not going to do that. This is elbow off the top. We're going to crack these things and see what we get. See what we get. See what we get. Where's my knife? I never have a pair of scissors or anything. I feel like I saw a pair of scissors behind me at some point. I did. I had a pair of scissors behind me. That's exciting. All right, let's, uh, I don't know how to do this. It's such an expensive box. The moment I do this, like automatically I'm losing a good couple of hundred dollars. There we go. Nice, slicey, slicey. No turning back now. That security seal is broken. We are not turning back, people. This is the real deal. This is the real thing. This is happening. Let's do this right now. For some people who like to see it, there's a... As I've got the D4405023 official AFL licensed product, which is now going to get sliced and slicey, slicey. Definitely no turning back now, eh? All right, here we go. The moment that is always just the best thing about opening entire box of cards is... Uh, oh, I love the fact they've got that dominance on the other side as well. Like normally you just open it up and there's just a blank thing and you just look at the packs, but oh, that looks really pretty. It's embossed. Is it embossed on the other? Yeah, it's embossed on the other side as well. It's embossed box. All right, let's pull a quick pack up. You can have a look at this. It says a, uh, one of those sort of matte packs. Feels very matte-like. Eight premium cards. It's got that silver and black. Again, if you couldn't see it very well, there is our ratios on the back. So everything from, from uh, the medal winners down We'll be lucky if we pull them. Looking beautiful, looking smick. And I completely forgot, like I'm sure you've already noticed in the background, but I also bought the um, the binder as well, which doesn't have any pages in it or anything like that, but I got my spare pages I can put in there. It's just one of those business folders, like obviously just sent to one of those printing agencies and look, you know, quite frankly, I still feel like they should give us some pages inside there, a premium product, make it feel premium. You know, you give us, you know, you give us pages for this, why not you give us for the like the premium one that we're paying just an incredible amount for? All right, so these are the packs. There is eight premium cards in each box. We are going to get cracking, eh? We'll do half a box. Take out the middle ones, and we need uh, not not used to opening like three sections. It's strange to me. Uh, which means I need half of this. Is that how that works? So I take these and this. 
throw these over here. That will be 18. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. All right, 18. We have got 18 packs. We're going to be cracking up first half of this box in this video. And then tomorrow, come back 8.30 in the morning and we will have the second part of this box opening. All right, here we go. First pack, select 2020 dominance. So if you don't know, these packs are so, so hard to get. So, so hard to get. And, ah, all right. Joel Hamling in the base, the first card we are. Right, so they come out this way. All right, let's spin it around. Let's see what it is. Oh, these commons look fantastic. All we've seen so far is the um, Hawthorne ones. And that common looks absolutely spectacular. Essendon right there, wearing the indigenous jumpers. Actually, they're both wearing indigenous jumpers. That's awesome. I love the fact they're doing that. All right, I feel, I feel like we definitely go for them back. There's the Frio one, Joel Hamling. There's the Swan Colors, obviously very similar. I was kind of hoping, I was, for a moment there, I thought all of the things were going to be on that. We got Charlie in the blue. Big Charlie Dixon. And <laughs> we got our box. <laughs> of course that happened. This is a 1 in 36 2018 premieres, 2018. Really? Really? The Tigers won in 2017 and 2019, and I pulled the 2018. Come on, guys. All right, let's turn it over. Let's, let's see what number, what, if it was 2018. Oh, I would imagine 173 of 275. So we got the players um, that were in the game, not just the Eagles, but also Collingwood as well. Um, i got a little bit of description of the game. This was a wicked game, if you remember. Collingwood got out to a massive lead. Not a massive lead, but big lead for a grand final. And the Eagles just slowly pegged them back. And of course, that goal, oh, that goal, that goal on the boundary line to put them in front. Oh, how can anyone forget that? I can guarantee you calling supporters have not forgotten that. All right. Well, this is our, a box hit. This is a box hit in the first pack, believe it or not. A box hit in the first pack. Let's get some sleevey sleeves on this. Let's pop this one into uh, one of my Pokemon sleeves. It is... Arceus, Diagla, and Palkia on the back. All right, let's finish off. I think we got one more in here, which is Brandon Parfit, who's having a great season so far. And James Sisley in the Hawks. Man, don't... Doesn't this just already look more pretty and beautiful and colorful than, like, all the other commons from Select? I think this may be my favorite common Select, my favorite looking Select commons. These look fantastic. The thing is, we're not sure if there's going to be any packs with no pulls in it. I'm not actually sure yet because I haven't seen any of this opened up. I haven't seen Matt Crouch on the back there. I haven't seen any of this opened up um, or anything like that. Harry Taylor from the Cats. Charlie Cameron. Nick Natanui. All right, so we can go three deep without having an issue. So uh, we have absolutely, I have absolutely no idea if we are going to be getting... Sorry, I sort of stopped my Matthew Suckling. I sort of stopped halfway because I just got excited to see what comes out. It is! <laughs> Wait, whoa! High Flyers, High Flyers, what's that? What's that, what's that, what's that? High Flyers are one in 216. Boys, ladies and gentlemen, everyone in between, we are pulling a great box, Matty Lloyd. 33 of 60, we have got a high flyer of Matty Lloyd. Wow, what a first two packs, eh? And we got a high flyer right there in Matthew Lloyd. Look at that. Look at that, boys, boys, ladies, ladies, gentlemen, kids of all ages. We are on fire. I just got excited. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, all right. I already love this set. Already love this set. Unfortunately, this set is going to be near impossible for people to find, but I'm already loving the look of these cards. Already loving these, uh, this box. I think I've already like, doing good things here. Shane Edwards, my first tiger. Go Tigers. And see what the tiger base looks like. Charlie Constable from the Cats. Luke Shui from the Eagles. Man, we are on a fire. Josh Kelly, what a gun. There he is. Go Tigers. That's what the tiger one looks like. Looks pretty good to me. We've got Brad Crouch. We had Matt Crouch in the last pack. Now we got Brad Crouch, Jake Riles, and all right, that's the that's the Josh Bruce. And the special cut is oh, we got a first All Australian Tommy Stewart back pocket for All Australian 2019. Now these cards are not numbered. This is a much much better looking card than last year's one. It looks really pretty, and I love uh, the, just that little bit of like darkness in the center kind of contrast with the white on the side. It's a really, really beautiful card, and definitely one of the cards I really want from this set is uh, the Basher Hooli All-Australian. You guys know Basher's my boy. 
Basher is my guy, favorite player, and uh, he is uh, he's represented in the All Australian cards. Oh, this just is this just exciting? I feel so excited and so privileged to be opening these. Uh, James Frawley. So we can go three deep. Shane McKernan. Before we get to the special card, oops, just toss McKernan away like that. Sorry, McKernan. All right, Tom McDonald for the Demons. Um, I will after the I will eventually in a future video tell you if I get all of the base set as well. Jack Martin having a great season for the Blues. All right, we got one more. Oh, we got the rookie card. No, that was our. Oh, just had to go one more dear. All right, we've got a rookie card of Francis Evans from the Cats. Um, draft pick forty one. Now I'd imagine for the, these ones you want draft pick number, so the same number as a draft pick, or the same number as a jumper number, which is one hundred seventy six. There's no way. There's no way that his uh. <laughs> his jumper is 176. So that is not a jumper number or anything like that. But there is one. Uh, this is our first rookie card. We should get three rookie cards out of this. Obviously, the rookie cards you're chasing is Matty Rowell. Surely, surely, surely. Matty Rowell is already show proving to be an absolute gun. And unfortunately, and like was in the Brown, like I reckon probably was in Brownlow contention before he got injured. Like we'll find out on Brownlow night. But I feel like he definitely would have been in Brownlow contention before he got uh, injured. Ben Stratton. These cards are beautiful. They're really good quality. And oh, we got the logos as well. We got the pie logos, of course. All right, Travis Boak, having a good season again for the for the power. We got two logos in this one. We got the crows and the pies. Trini Cochin, go Tigers. And one more Dyson Heppel and... Oh, we got our first base parallel. As I mentioned in the video, oh yeah, look at those circles. They really move underneath that light, isn't it? That looks great. Brad Crouch is a good one to get as well. That is number 145 of 350, so that is definitely not a jumper number. But, oh, it looks beautiful. People like me who like opening videos, I reckon I could just do it in a video where I just move this backwards and forwards for 20 minutes and people would watch it. Because that looks fantastic. These are beautiful cards. You've got to call it out. Select has done a great job. They may have not done the best thing as far as getting cards into collectors' hands uh, by doing a whole lot of pre doing the pre the pre pre sale, but these are beautiful cards. It's a beautiful set and one of the best looking sets I think um, ever printed. These look oh, just the the bases just look so good. The base cards just look so good. They look that premium. That like water spot, like sky sort of cloudy background just looks fantastic. Man. Big ups to select. This is a really great product. I was a bit disappointed with Prestige just because of the rewalt. Just the re the rewalt. I, I, I actually thought that was Jack rewalt. Just because of the go Tigers. Just because of the uh, reprints and not, not the rewalts. There's another base. Jared Harbour. And just a regular. Okay, there are regular. Okay, people, there are just non-special packs, which makes me a sad panda, which means we're going to get at least Maybe three, four, I guess, I'm guessing, possibly. Nothing packs in this. I really don't like the fact that you open up a pack of cards and you uh, don't get anything. So, yes, I have that, that pack officially confirms there are packs that have nothing in them. Shield, Saints, Jaeger Bomber Mirror. Let's go from the back. Oh, God, they're just beautiful cards. I am actually in awe of just how beautiful these cards are. So far, the only thing, the only knock I've got on this is the fact there are packs with nothing in them. On the rise. Now we should get a couple of these. Uh, last one was Liam Jones. This is a uh, Clayton Oliver on the rise. And that is numbered 117, not a jumper number, but 117. We should be getting, how many of these on the rises should we get? So we should get four on the rises in this box. And there is one of the absolute guns of the demons and surely one of the main spearheads. Him and Petrarca, they've, him, Petrarca, Gorni, they've got to take the demons forward, forward in the future. And I know right now they're keen to try to get some final sign for him as well. So they've got that game in hand against the Bombers, which if the Bombers played, if that game actually got played back in the day, like when it was supposed to play. Dominance, this is uh, probably the first card of the set. A, um, the title card, Blues for the regular. Rory Sloan looking good. Nice haircut in Rory Sloan though. I like that haircut. We've got David Swallow. And we got another base parallel. We've got a bunch of these ones. And wow, I'm getting great players for the base parallels. All right, let's just... Yeah. Trippy. You're getting sleepy. Sleepy. 
that's <laughs> trying to hypnotize you. And that is 109. That is definitely not a uh, bomb's number, but look at that. I, oh yeah, really like these base parallels. I definitely need all of the set of the tiger. So if you're opening any of this and you find some tigers and you see a, a, uh, a parallel that you're interested in trading for me, let me know. I don't know how many packs we Are you paying attention at home? We've already pulled a one in 200 plus packs. We've got our box pull so far. What we're looking for, uh, what we still need is obviously our auto for this one. Eagles in the, in the team card. Paddy Dangerfield, the absolute legend, the absolute gun from them. Uh, a Basha Hooli All Australian is also something that I'm desperate, just personally would like. Gorney, just talking about Gorn. That is a fierce looking pitcher of Gorn. Gorn is probably one of my favorite non Richmond players, and that is a great pitcher of Gorney. Hayden Crozier. Um, one more at the back. The Dockers title card. And All Australian for the bump. There you go. Look at that. Double bump. Also, probably one of my favorite non Richmond players as well. I know I've got a lot of them. I know I, I got a lot of them, but I just love watching those players play footy. And especially at the moment, man, the bomb is absolutely killing it at the moment. Trying to drag the Bulldogs into those finals and make an impact. And I've talked about it before. I've talked about it before. The Bulldogs do make it the finals. They could be a surprise packet. They could be a surprise packet. I had them tipped for top four at the start of the year. So you could very well be quite the surprise packet. All right, let's just keep plowing through here. I don't know how long this video is going to go, but I feel like, you know, it's... This is a premium product, which means it needs premium amount of time on YouTube. Publio. Adam Trelaw. Oh, like Collingwood. I don't know if we've seen Collingwood yet, but yeah, black and white really pops, doesn't it? That black and white really, really pops. Makes it look very classy. A bit of class up in this thing, which is definitely something that I do not bring to these videos. Buddy Franklin, brilliant. I haven't seen a lot of doubles, so maybe we are. Brennan Ellis, go former Tigers. Um, maybe we will be... Let's have a look here. Yeah, one more here. Uh, maybe we will be able to get the full base set in one box, but I'll let you know how we go. And another on the rise of Alex Witherden. That's awesome. Number is 21. <gasps> what number is, what number is, what number is, what number is, what number is Alex Witherden? Oh, I, I now got to look it up. Is he, is he 21? We were, we were very, very close on that. His number is 29. And we got 21. We were very close on the uh, jumper number on Alex with it. He's having a great season. I actually moved him into my fantasy team, and he's now one of my top scorers. I moved him in after Jeremy Howe got injured. He's been doing great things for my fantasy. So very happy with that on the rise. And again, with premier with uh, Premiership, Dusty. <laughs> we got the Dusty on the back, boys. Dusty on the back. Um, with the uh, Heath Shaw. Cameron Zaha. I'm going to take a little bit of time. Let you enjoy this one. Um, here we go. There's the Dusty. Go Tigers. Dusty looking strong and powerful as he always does. Um, with the Lions, Dan Houston. Shout out Dan Houston fan. I can already see there's a All-Australian in this one. So we're going to All-Australian. Fingers crossed it is Basha Hooley. That's the All-Australian I really desperately want. And it is not, but it's Tommy Hawkins, which is my second cat. I got the other Tom, didn't I? Yeah, I got other Tom. Tom Stewart, and what is he, number four or something? And, oh, there's, <laughs> I was like, and the jumper number? No, there's no there's no numbering on the old Australian cards. All right, good stuff so far. I'm really enjoying opening these cards. Not going to lie. Really enjoy. What do we got left? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We got seven left to crack open. Let's do this thing. Oh, I just found out how I'd normally open cards. Um, Matt Bunton. I did, I did a, I opened the pack without thinking about it. Bomber's uh, logo card. Eddie. Gotta love Eddie. Gotta love Eddie. Tigers, go Tigers. I may as well show. The back is, of course, the checklist, uh, which is all the players. So these are the players in each one that you get in the base. Andrew Keith, let's have a look here. Uh, looks like we got another All Australian. Looking for that bash. Looking for that bash. Basha! No, it's not. <laughs> it's not even an All Australian. All right, we have got another. Wow, I am pulling fantastic parallels of players. The Giants captain, Cogs, Cadniglio. And jumper number is definitely, jumper number is definitely not 297. All right, we got a deep one there. Let's have a look. Let's just watch those. Look at those circles. All right, you are getting sleepy, sleepy. And bark like a dog. Go. Bark like a giant. Wait, what sound does a giant make? All right, my new thing is every time I pull that hollow, I try to hypnotize you. Definitely what I'm going to be trying to do now. All right. Keep plowing through, getting through. Oops, knock the camera. Let's reset a little bit. Knock that camera. Michael Hurley from the uh, bom Bombers. We nearly said Demons. Uh, let's have a look right here. Lewis Taylor. All right. We're still looking for a couple of rookies. We're still looking for... 
Mark Murphy. We're still looking for a Bradley Hill. We're still looking for our auto and... Oh, we got our auto and it is of Jed Anderson from the North Melbourne Football Club. Jed Anderson looking fantastic. Look at that beautiful auto sitting on there like that. Oh, number three and... It is number 160 of 175. Whoa, what a beautiful, beautiful card that is. This is an authentic signature card by Jed Anderson from the North Melbourne Football Club. Where's my sleeves? Grab one of those Pokemon sleeves. Sleeve these bad boys up. There we go. Look at that. Jed Anderson in the signature. Love getting a signature card. All right, we have got a great box so far. We got a signature. We've got our box hit and we've got a one in 200 plus cards. We're 16 from memory in the high flyers. Five packs left to go in this half of the box. Please make sure you are hitting that subscribe button and you're hitting the bell icon to know when the second part of this arm um, to open it in that weird way where I'm thinking about it again. No, I just rip it open on the side. Please make sure you're doing those things. I've also just hit 800 subscribers, which means I've got my 800 subscriber vi giveaway video happening for all you wonderful people who have subscribed to my channel. And you are not going to want to miss out because... Look, I'll give you... Go Tigers, just caddy. I'll give you a bit of a hint here. Uh, let's have a look here. Uh, that one there. Looks like another Australian could be going for that bash. I'll give you a bit of hint because if you like these looks of these cards, because if you like the look of these cards, I managed to secure a couple of extra loose packs. So trust me, you might want to subscribe and be part of my 800 subscriber giveaway because there's a good chance you get some of these cards. And... Our brown, our brown, it's going to call him brown low. Our Ben Brown parallel in the background. All right, you are getting sleepy, sleepy, and hop like a kangaroo. Go. Did you hop like a kangaroo? 207 out of 305. Definitely not a jumper number, but good looking card. Interesting facial expression there for poor Benny Brown. He's had an up and down season, he's had a tricky one. Good North box, eh? Signature from North and a Benny Brown parallel. Feels pretty good to me. Cats have got some cards in here too. Sard, Goldstein, speaking of North. Alex Witherden, one of our on the rise. Tex Walker. Jack Viney. Stephen Hill. Let's have a look. I don't want to. All right, let's screw up that one. There's that. I think this might be just a, yeah, this is just a nothing pack. Sorry to, sorry to let you all down. I told you there was going to be a couple of them. It's just a, at least if an, at least with a nothing pack, it looks colorful. Am I right? There shouldn't be nothing packs. There shouldn't be nothing pack select. Just saying. Just saying. Shouldn't be a nothing pack. Put it. Put a couple of non non um, numbered cards in there for us. Put like you know, legends of the past and just pictures of like previous players from various from from the teams and versus you know players in the new teams or something like that. Put an extra card in there. Doesn't take a genius to work out how to print how to make a new card. I just the, the old feel bads. The old feel bads. Good news is that there is absolutely no way that the kids will be just easily opening these one single packs and getting nothing in there. And we got another parallel, Mitch Lewis, who was actually our base preview. Uh, here we go. You ready? You were getting sleepy, 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 and squawk like a hawk. Did you squawk? 80 of 350, not a jumper one, but however, oh God, they just look good, don't they? They just look so good. All right, we've had a great opening here. A really, really great opening. And we have still got another half a box to go. Um, we got two packs left to go in this video. Please make sure you're hitting that sub button and hitting that bell icon uh, for part two of this box tomorrow. And of course, if you're a subscriber to my channel, you'll be entered into my subscriber giveaway, which I will be, a bit of a spoiler, there will be a chance if you wish, if it's something you want, Sammy Walsh right there, if it's something that you wish to happen, Michael Walters, absolute gun, a bit of an up and down season, absolute gun in general. Uh, that is definitely a card of some type. And if you wish, you will be able to get some of your hands on some of these cards in some packs. So, on the rise, Jade Gresham. That is a great card to get. For those who don't know, Jade Gresham is very close to my heart. I actually just spat on the card for a second. Oh, great. Um, <laughs> just spitting on expensive cards. Good job. 151 is not a... Jump parallel, however, it is a beautiful card and very happy to get that on the rise. All right, one pack to go left in this video. Here we go, let's crack this one. All right, I've probably, I don't know how long this video is gonna take, to be honest. Like, I feel like it's gonna be a bit of a longer one. I'm really enjoying opening these cards, really, really enjoying it. All right, let's not finish on a nothing pack. That's our aim, people. 
Start repeating. Something, something, something. Get something. You want something. Just keep saying something over and over and over again. Let's, uh, oh, all right, we got something. Something over. Go, Tigers Jack Rewell. Well, we've got a another parallel. There it is. Look at that. All right, you ready? I'm going to hypnotize you again. All right, you're getting sleepy. Sleepy. Your eyelids are getting heavy. Very sleepy. Now, uh, take the soul of another human being. Go. <laughs> Didn't know what to do for a demon. <laughs> Is that what demons do? I have no idea. 88 in the, um, in the, uh, for the number. I just noticed that the back also has like that similar, sh the color background in the, in the thing. Is that, I assume that's the normal for all of them, right? Let's grab some cogs. Yeah. That like sort of stained glassy sort of approach. Whoa. Pretty. All right, that is part one done. Let's have a quick look at our pools. All right, starting off with our all Australians. So we got Tommy Stewart in the back pocket for the Cats. We got Tommy Hawkins, double Tom from the Cats in the full forward, who I kind of expect, or could be between, I would, I would expect Tommy. He's had such a great season. And Bump on the wing, looking great. All right, our parallels with Stephen Coniglio from the uh, Giants. James Merck. Merksham. I didn't even I didn't even say who card it was, I'm realizing. Mitch Lewis from the Hawks. The bump again. And Brad Crouch from the um Crows. Oh my god, it's I'm really struggling here. On the rise is Jade Gresham. Up. Oh. <laughs> ben Brown with the parallel. I'm so good at this. It's not like I have a YouTube channel and like over 800 subscribers and people actually spend their time watching me do this. It's not like, you know, I, I do anything like that. Alex Witherden on the rise as well. I'm happy with these on the rise as well. Witherden, Oliver and um, Gresham. Very happy with those on the rises. Our draft picks is France and Evan, Francis Evans. Cat supporters, let me know. Is he uh, is he playing games? I'm not actually sure. Is he getting a game in the side? It's a pretty pretty tough team to get a game into, of course. We've got the 2018 premieres of the Eagles for our commemorative card. We've got our signature of Jed Anderson from the Kangas. And the pot so far, look at that. One in 216, the Essendon legend, Matthew Lloyd in the high flyer. Taking a massive specky, big, big mark, huge card. That is a pull and a half. That is something we could have easily not pulled. That is exciting stuff. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoy my content, please make sure you are liking and commenting down below. If you are new to the channel, would love for you to consider maybe hitting that sub button. Or if you haven't subbed, maybe hitting that sub and the bell icon just to know when future videos are coming out. This is part one. We are only halfway through the box and we've already got so much fun and specialness and so much color. It's just such beautifully colorful cards. And so we've still got another half a box to come. So please make sure you come back tomorrow for those cards and see what else we pull. But apart from all that, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you so much for watching this video and I will see you in the next one.